morning. Just launched the boat. Get ready to go down, do some fishing. Just a little funky when it comes to the weight. Down and try by the bridge. Mm -hmm. 
got one. Got one. I don't know how big he is. Oh, he's not bad. He's giving me quite a head nod here. Oh, I don't know. He, oh, oh, no, that's a bass. That's a good size bass. Oh, oh, come on, come on. I'm gonna fl boat flip him. Ready? One, two, three, up and in. Oh, that's a good size. Not horrible, not great, but good size. Good start for today. Right on the bottom of the lip. Come on, dude. Give me my hook back. Nice, good start to the day. Just gave him a little way. <coughs> Excuse me, two pounds. Nice start to the day. And back you go. The fog is so thick. That's, that's nice. That's actually, either he's balled up in some weeds or he's a decent size. Because he's pulling pretty good. He's deep. I don't even see him yet. Oh. Oh, deep jump. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, he is strong. I don't think he's a... I don't think he's any bigger than the other one. No, I don't think so. About the same size. Yeah. Feels a little heavier, a little stronger. Might be a little thicker. Yeah, I think he's a little thicker. He'll probably weigh a bit more. But... <sighs> nice bottom hook again. Beauty. Sweet. I don't know, that guy fought a little harder. He was a little deeper, a little stronger. But he's weighing the same, two pounds. So we'll get him back in. There he goes. Coast in the morning to find a place where no one knows our faces or our names. If we don't leave now and by, never make it. That's what I've been throwing today. A little Strike King spinner bait. So come away with me. Oh, I'm gonna move up to you. We're getting into the water. It's too much. I can't move. We can fall asleep where the land and ocean meet. Wake up to the sounds of no one around. And as the sun comes up, the glow will show us where we need to go. You would do that. Oh, look at the little fry jumping in there. Um, she's got something chasing her, so we threw the camera back up to see if we can catch it.
There's definitely stuff feeding here because when we first rolled up, we seen them. And they were chasing my line a bit too. But no big strikes yet. I think it's probably pickerel. This is where we used to catch a lot of pickerel before. And they're kind of dumb. So... Oh boys, I got a big old catch here. 10 pounds of weeds. Yeah, it's probably definitely pickerel in here. We used to catch some real good monsters in here years ago. That was before we recorded anything. We really should have then because, man, we were catching some big ones in here. Actually, there was one, remember, we couldn't even get it in the boat? I pulled him up on the side, and his head was, the head to the dorsal was uh, as tall as what the boat was. I didn't even get to see him, and then my line snapped. We didn't carry, um, we didn't carry nets back then either, which we do now. But of course, we haven't hooked that guy again. I guess they don't get that big by being too, too dumb. I don't know, it might not be any good. Nice. <laughs> nice little chain.
just took a little pit stop. A little beach on the lake here. Nice spot. Watching the fish jump out in the middle. We're not getting any bites out there though. Give her hell, bud. Give her hell. A little high performance four cylinder. <laughs> I haven't had any luck with this thing at all. He took, oh, he just took my, the hook. He broke you off. You Oh. Now you gotta get a different one. Damn it. It's all right, I guess. Oh. Now you gotta get a different one. Well, damn it. I wonder what he was. Did you I even know, get to but see? He was really heavy. Well, he was probably wrapped up in the weeds. Probably was. Because it, it didn't seem like he was fighting a lot. But he took it as soon as it dropped. Yeah, it was probably a bass then. kayak and a, a paddle board all going in unison there <laughs> over there Here's my fishing story of the day. The tall tale, as they say. We saw a big fish break water behind the boat. Threw my line two or three times, no action. Fourth, I think it was the fourth cast. I seen a wake behind me as it was coming in. When it got close to the boat, when I could see my lure and see what was behind it, it had to have been a six or seven pound bass. He was a good three foot. As soon as he saw me and I saw him, he turned and darted. And I've been throwing ever since and he ain't nowhere to be found. He oh. just turned it off, I think. No, it was off. Oh, oh my god. Off. Look at this monster. Holy! I wish I could have got that on film, bringing him in. There we go. There's the guy I was looking for. Holy, what a bass, what a fight. He did not want to come in. He took me way down deep and he fought the entire time. Look at that mouth. We had to use the net to bring him in. Couldn't get him in on the line. I couldn't, I couldn't lift him over the boat. I was scared my line was gonna snap. That was incredible. Thanks to Mrs. East Coast for the assist on that beast. Look at him. He's huge. This has gotta be a new PB for me gotta be gotta be a new PB look at the size of him that's incredible grab another one like this mm. 
Wow. You weigh him? I'm gonna weigh this guy. Well, he measured out four pounds, so not quite the monster I wanted, but I'll take him for today. I don't know if my scale is right either, because I'll tell you, this guy feels a lot heavier than four. He is, he's from the bottom of my foot to up past my knee. We'll have to measure that later. I don't have a tape with me. Unbelievable. Let's get this monster back in the water. We got some pictures of him. Let's put him back in. Oh, he bit me. Let's get him back in so he can live to fight another day. Oh wow, what a beautiful fish. Absolutely beautiful. That is a nice small mouth. You all right, buddy? You got it? Oh yeah, he's got it, there he goes. Little loon, buddy. Diving under. I'll put the camera back on me in case I get another hit. I'm really upset I didn't get that on camera. <laughs> he fought me like crazy. We're just trolling back across the lake back to the dock now. All three of my big bass today were trolling. Which is really weird, that's not normally what happens for me, but it's normally her on the troll. But today, it was me on the troll. <sighs> We're just taking a couple casts now where we used to catch a bunch of white perch. Right before we go in, this is where we dock, so. I'm not going to catch any of those with this on, but she might. I've just got on a big lure. You never know, there might be a big pickerel lurking around out here. We just saw a school of minnows. Yeah, they were in a perfect ball. Almost looked like one big fish. I thought for sure it was one big fish until it got closer to the boat. So chances are, if there's minnows out there this deep, there ain't no big guys out here. But you never know. So we'll take a couple, yeah, we'll take a couple casts. Oh, that must be his uh, sea -Doo trailer. The loon is over there fishing. Doing a better job than I am. I think he's at that uh, minnow ball we saw. No, he's doing a better job than I am. Mr. Loon. Hello, Mr. Loon. Look at that. Yeah, he's hunting. Yeah. He's catching. Oh, he is. He's got the. He's chasing the ball, cause I just seen them swarm. Look at him. Go around circles. Yeah, he's corralling them. Yeah, I'm gonna give up if you're here fishing, Mr. Loon, cause you do a way better job than I do. pretty good time fishing um, but that's over because it's hot out now <laughs> so get the boat back out just clean it up and then it'll be time to say goodbye to uh, the little shack again this weekend but we do think we're coming back again next weekend and we will be bringing that boat because I did not bring in the biggest one of today and I am going to try again next week. 
he was at least three foot. The one I did bring in measured out at 24. Um, he was still, you know, four and a half pounds, four, four and a half pounds. Um, but uh, I want the three footer. He was a monster. So we will be back again next weekend, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, and give it another go. So that's it for this week. We're packing up, getting ready to get out of here, and we'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>